Hello again. Um, this is yet another of the... I think I didn't really do a proper intro, but sort of this is one of Robbie's ghost story thingy, thingies and all that sort of stuff. Um, one thing I, I haven't done in some of my other intros is that I actually take it from the point of view as a sceptic. I, I sort of... You know, something will happen and it will be kind of like, oh, that cold breeze is the result of a window being opened or... Um, you know, like, um, say, a, a door creaking or something like that, and you go over to the door and it turns out that um, it does have that little propensity to move, so it's not perfectly still, it sort of has a little bit of leeway, and that's what causes the, the sound of your door to move, and, and, and things like that. Um, but an, an interesting time when an obnoxious sceptic was dealt with was at the penitentiary chapel in Hobart. Um, this guy was going around and he was just, you know, it, it's, it's okay to be a sceptic, but don't ruin people's tours by just being really obnoxious about it. Um, you know, so a story would be told and this guy's like, oh, what a load of crap. And um, it, it just kind of made us think, oh, God, shut up. You know, we're trying to enjoy this. You know, and you're, you're really bringing the whole thing down. Um but there was a story about a, a particular cell um, in there. I um, can't remember quite which one it was. But the story was that you'd, you'd look into this particular cell and um, you'd feel like the end of your nose was being smacked. You know, so like a hand was smacking the end of your nose. Like, and um, so you probably worked out where this is going now. <laughs> where... Um, I looked into this particular cell, and right next to me, this the obnoxious sceptic was looking into the cell as well. Actually, B is going to be a good example for this. Um, so we sort of looked, both looked in, and in the corner of my eye, I could actually see like that. And um, I was like, hmm. Didn't, you know, didn't really think much of it. But he then went really quiet. And uh, for the rest of the tour, sort of fairly demure, really didn't, you know, a bit of a change in, in personality, really. Um, and then at the end of the, the thing, you do that thing of congregating, oh, did anything happen to you? And, or do you want to talk about whatever? You know, like a lot of those ghost tours uh, will do. Um, so you can sort of, sort of, oh, yeah, that happened to me too. Oh, or I heard this, you know, whatever. So we were congregating, and, and it's like, and, and this guy could not get out of there fast enough. Um, he said, "Oh, I've got, I've got to go now. All right, see you later. Thanks for the little." <laughs> oh, okay. Um, and that's then when I sort of realised that um, he probably, and, and I sort of pictured it in my mind. I can still sort of picture it actually. So he must have had the end of his nose smacked because he recoiled like. You know, like he had the end of his nose smacked. Yeah. So sometimes they deal with the obnoxious sceptic. Sometimes sceptics do get dealt with on these tours. So that, that's, that's always interesting. But yeah, that's, that's what happened at Penitentiary Chapel in Hobart. Um, quite, a, quite an interesting place. I haven't been there since 2012, but that's the same place as had, had the lavender story. That was my, where I um, had the lavender story. Um, and any time I say story, it implies fiction. It's not because I couldn't be, you know, I don't, as I said in one, I don't read fiction. <laughs> it's just, I'm just not interested. Um, and once again, none of these are plagiarised. Oh, Bear looks a bit scared now. Um, none of these are plagiarised. None of these are Googled. None of these come from books or anything like that. Um, they're just things that have happened to, to me and, and people around me. Since, since I've successfully scared the scared Big Bear here, um, I'll let you go. And um, let me see. <laughs> yep. So anyway, we'll, we'll bid you adieu, and I'll see you next time. Alrighty. Ciao. 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 Ciao.